<laughs> I, I'll take the bottoms out. Let me see them. Ooh, they're beautiful. Do you like them? Yeah, I do love I them. I designed them. Wow, you designed them? Uh-huh. Now, you like? Buckle up, darlings, because we're diving into the world of the queen of pop herself, Madonna. Born Madonna Louise Ciccone in 1958, this five foot three dynamo has shattered records, defied expectations, and redefined what it means to be a pop star. With a trophy cabinet overflowing with Grammys, MTV Video Music Awards, and countless others, Madonna's influence on music, fashion, and culture is undeniable. Get ready to peek behind the curtain of the ultimate icon, the ever-evolving, boundary-pushing Madonna. Thing to him to get it played. And when he played it, everybody got up and started dancing to it, and it blew my mind. I mean, seriously, like, that was everything to me. Now let's talk about her favorite activities, interesting facts, and how she spends her money. Madonna's brand, Boy Toy Inc., showcases a range of items that reflect her artistic flair, including tour merchandise, apparel, and music-related products. These collections offer a glimpse into the aesthetic and thematic elements that Madonna cherishes and chooses to share with her fans. Madonna's wardrobe is legendary. We're talking a treasure trove of designer duds from Jean-Paul Gaultier's cone bra to Dolce & Gabbana's religious iconography looks. She also owns a collection of various artworks that are worth a minimum of $100 million. She owns one of only five paintings created by Frida Kahlo in addition to work from artists such as Picasso, Diego Rivera, Damien Hirst, and Marilyn Minter. Beyond collections, she also has a sentimental side. She's been known to hold onto things close to her heart, like a handwritten letter from Marlene Dietrich, a hero of hers. She's a dog lover, with her and her family enjoying the company of their French bulldog, Gypsy. One of Madonna's most notable philanthropic endeavors is her work with Raising Malawi, an organization she co-founded which aims to alleviate the hardships faced by Malawi's orphans and vulnerable children. Her commitment goes beyond mere financial contributions. Madonna matches every dollar donated to Raising Malawi, showcasing her deep investment in the cause. Her philanthropic reach is vast, supporting a multitude of charities and causes, including children's welfare, education, AIDS and HIV support, disaster relief and human rights. Her involvement in benefit concerts like Live Aid and Live Earth, and her innovative fundraising approaches, such as auctioning off personal performances, highlight her dedication to leveraging her influence for charitable causes. Beyond her philanthropy, Madonna's life is filled with intriguing facts that reflect her multifaceted personality. From rejecting a Hollywood Walk of Fame star to being recognized for her intelligence quotient, each facet of her life contributes to the intriguing mosaic that defines her. Madonna's culinary preferences are a blend of simple comfort foods and high-end indulgences. Her favorite snacks include Rice Krispies and salads, showcasing her appreciation for both humble and health-conscious choices. For a taste of luxury, she doesn't hesitate to savor caviar and burritos, balancing the spectrum of her gastronomic delights. While Madonna reigns supreme in the music world, her sporting interests reveal a gritty edge with a fondness for boxing and basketball. These choices reflect her dynamic and vigorous spirit, embodying the energy and resilience she exudes in her career and personal life. Madonna's fashion favorites are as iconic as her music. As previously mentioned, she has a particular affinity for designers like Dolce & Gabbana, Stella McCartney, and Jean-Paul Gaultier. Her style preferences resonate with her bold and pioneering persona, always on the cutting edge of trends and self-expression. In her music world, Madonna's favorite song is Live to Tell, a piece from her own illustrious catalog. Her admiration for Imagine by John Lennon also highlights her connection to music that resonates with profound messages and universal appeal. Films like To Kill a Mockingbird and The English Patient are among her favorites, reflecting her taste for stories with deep emotional resonance and critical acclaim. Madonna's bookshelf is filled with tales of romance, resistance, and revolution. The Bad Girl by Mario Vargas Llosa, Shantaram by Gregory David Roberts, and The Time Traveler's Wife by Audrey Niffenegger are some of her chosen reads, offering a window into her interests in complex narratives and rich character explorations. In a world full of colors, Madonna leans towards the intensity of black and blue, colors that mirror her multifaceted and deep persona. Interestingly, her least favorite color is orange, a little tidbit that adds a quirky edge to her character profile. Controversial, but... Yeah, it turned out that the controversial thing wasn't the song itself. It was my performance on the MTV Awards, the first MTV Awards that ever got yeah. She is getting on with her friends and family. Madonna's love life has been as colorful and varied as her career. From her marriage to Sean Penn in the 80s to her high-profile relationship with Vanilla Ice, the queen of pop has had her share of love and heartbreak. 
Notably, her relationship with Tupac Shekhar in the 90s ended on a note of introspection and societal reflection, revealing the complexities of love in the limelight. Her affair with Dennis Rodman and the whirlwind romance with Carlos Leon, who is the father of her daughter Lourdes, add layers to her intriguing romantic narrative. As a mother, Madonna's journey is nothing short of inspiring. Lords Leon, her firstborn with Carlos Leon, has stepped into the limelight with a burgeoning modeling career and even a foray into music, mirroring her mother's multifaceted talents. Rocco Ritchie, her son with director Guy Ritchie, along with David Banda, Mercy, and the twins Stella and Esther, complete the superstar's beautiful family. Each child, with their unique backgrounds and talents, contributes to Madonna's proud title as a dedicated mother. I don't know why. Why? I don't you've, know. Been, you've been wearing them for a while since I've known you. Decades. Yeah. And yeah. what got you into that? I just like, like the way it the way looks. looks. Mouth jewelry. And I have really ugly teeth. With that being said, let's discuss how she earns money. Madonna is a legendary artist and entertainer who has conquered the music world and beyond. She sold over 300 million albums and is the best selling female recording artist of all time, with a staggering $1.5 billion in concert ticket revenue making her the highest-grossing female touring artist worldwide. Forbes has named her the top-earning female musician an unprecedented 11 times in four decades, and she's shown her business savvy by founding the entertainment company Maverick and producing four fashion brands, including Material Girl and Truth or Dare by Madonna. Madonna has also been a trailblazer in brand partnerships, starting with her endorsement deal with Pepsi in 1989, and her astute business sense has led to the success of ventures like her coffee table book, Sex, which sold 1.5 million copies in its first few days. Madonna, the queen of pop, boasts an impressive net worth of approximately $850 million as of early 2024. Get ready to take a virtual tour of her ultra-luxurious mansions. Her longtime abode in Manhattan's Upper East Side is a magnificent four-story townhouse with 13 bedrooms, 13 bathrooms, nine fireplaces, and a 3,000-square-foot garden. In Portugal, she owns an 18th century mansion on 5.5 acres, which serves as a luxurious retreat for her and her children. In 2009, she spent $32 million on a townhouse in New York with a wine cellar, elevator, and nine fireplaces. She also has a 50-acre equestrian property in Bridgehampton, New York, and a former Beverly Hills mansion that she sold in 2013 for $19.5 million. In 2021, she acquired the weekend's Hidden Hills Mansion for $20 million and listed it for sale for $26 million in 2022. Now let's see what type of vehicles you will find in her garage. A Maybach 62S, a rare luxury car with a price tag of over $500,000. A Jaguar XE, a blend of style, performance, and advanced technology. A Cooper S, known for its iconic design and nimble handling. A Maybach 57, another luxurious model from the Maybach line, a BMW 7 Series, a symbol of sophistication and cutting-edge automotive technology. An Audi R8, a stunning sports car with remarkable performance. She also owns a private jet. That's all for today's video and thanks for watching it, but don't stop here. There's more where that came from. Check out our other videos for more great content.